All right, we're, we're checking out the side story. The side story picks up from campaign chapter 14. You may have difficulties understanding the story if you haven't watched the prequel. I did. Ah, <sighs> <sighs> the Pioneer Gang. So this is when they separated, right? When they, when they gave Modernia over. <sighs> Hey, Snow White, are you okay? Oh, uh, I I'm okay. She has such anime eyes. You certainly don't look it. Appearances can be deceiving. What drivel dost thee spew? Shall we switch? Snow White has had to carry Marion this whole time. Thine armor is also most prodigious. I'm sure tis a most formidable weight to bear. Hmm. It's no picnic, that's for sure. Alright, I guess sh she's out cold. Let's switch then. <sighs> Mary, she's so sad. No! As I live and breathe, she is sound asleep. Passed out is more like it. Take a break, Snow White. Hmm. Do not blame thine self. You had nothing to do with her ending up this way. I gotta say, this is the first time I'm hearing them speak in English. They're usually speaking the Japanese. It's a bit awkward, but I can see, uh, you know, I see the appeal. Uh, I'll, I'll, we'll press on. It's my fault. Very well. Let's say it is. Be that as it may, we will share your burden. Both emotional and physical. Ah, these are, these three are homies. <sighs> is it so difficult to comprehend? Are we not comrades? Come on, let me carry her. It may not seem like it, but I'm quite adept at carrying things. <laughs> it may not seem like it, but I can carry things. That's... Or, I'm quite adept. I'm good at carrying things. When did thou develop such prowess? Oh my gosh, come on. Ah, I see. Thine skills must have blossomed whilst helping the others recuperate. That too. But I've also hauled my fair share of deer. A deer? Never mind. Why would Scarlet be confused about that? Forget I said anything. Come on, hand her over to me. <sighs> Very well. Be gentle with her. That's my dirty. You don't have to be gentle with her. She's a triple S unit. Snow White carefully hands over Marion, whom she had been carrying to Rapunzel. Let's see. Gather the arms. Then lift onto the shoulders like so. <gasps> Impressive. <laughs> I told you so. Uh, Let's get a move on, shall we? We're just you're literally just carrying another Nikkei. Rapunzel starts to walk off. Drag, drag. <laughs> Marion's feet drag on the ground. Her feet are being subjected to the most unusual punishment. <laughs> Oh my gosh, Scarlet, have you always talked like this? So long as it doesn't slow down the pace, it should be fine. This is true. This is very interesting. I'm, I'm, I'm curious how... If this is just pure cutscene, you know? <sighs> oh yeah, this is just pure cutscene. This is basically the same game, except there's no... There's no strange intersplicing of battling raptures for no reason. <laughs> Are you awake? Where am I? Oh no. Let go of me! Marion squirms frantically and Rapunzel staggers as she attempts to restrain her. Okay, okay, I'm putting you down. Just relax. Uh, let me go! Chill out, will you? If you keep flopping around, you'll end up touching me! Huh? What? I said let go! Oh, yes! <laughs> Rapunzel! Bud. Rapunzel collapses to the ground in a heap. <coughs> Where is the commander? I want to see the commander. Oh, uh, no. You can't do that. Why not? I'm going to see him, and that's final. You can't. Commander? Commander! Where are you? Rappi! Anise! Neon! Anybody? <laughs> Has everyone abandoned me? 
Oh no! That's the hard part of watching this. Oh. Poor, poor Marion. This isn't real, Commander. I told you, he's not here. We are the only ones here. That, that's impossible. I want to go back. I want to see the Commander. <laughs> It's gonna be like this for a while, just telling her, no, you can't go. Me, the commander, I'm on a mission to be in a world where Marion could be with us. Which is, in my way, in a way, it's like, why not? I mean, right now, in the current story, we are setting up a whole completely different outpost. Completely outside of the arc. There is no reason why Marion can't be with us. Is it this way? No. I, I knew that. I was going to head in the opposite direction! If you go back now, they'll have you dissected on an operating table within an hour. I mean, she's heretic level. How would how would they do that? You know? In many ways, why would I, the commander, or Marion, this heretic level Nike, even have to put up with any restrictions from the Ark? The Ark is like nothing to us now. I can defend myself! I'm sure you can. But you wouldn't be the only one in danger. They would kill your precious commander. Okay, maybe don't come back. <sighs> he will do whatever it takes to protect you. And as punishment for turning his back on the entire Ark, they'll kill him. I mean, she got a point. <laughs> I mean, I've, I've been threatened by worse things. I don't know. I wouldn't be scared of the Ark. Man, fuck the Ark. <laughs> the situation truly is most unjust. A bitter pill to swallow, forsooth. Forsooth. You remove that out of your vocabulary now, Scarlet. That means nothing. But what of the feelings of my lord who sent you to us? He has put you in our care because he himself is powerless. Try to understand. Now is not the time to fuss. All right, Scarlet. What he needs right now is time. Time to become stronger. I mean, there's no reason why we couldn't have been traveling with the Pioneers. So you must be patient. <sighs> what if he doesn't come back for me? Aww, Marianne. Do you really take him for the mendacious type? No, the commander would never lie to me. There you have it. Hence why we're asking you to wait a little longer. He will come back for you. And until then, we will protect you. I promise. <sighs> Keep walking. The road is long. I like these. I like these a lot, actually. These are actually really cool. As a as a big Nikkei lore nut, I am all for all these side stories. I want to see what, what every Nikkei is going through. And given the gigantic roster that this game has, there are so many stories to explore. I can only imagine how hard it is to pick what story strings should they follow, you know? I am so interested in seeing what they do with the anniversary, the, the half anniversary. Man, half anniversary was nuts last year. And then the an actual anniversary was even crazier. <sighs> she seems to have calmed down. Praise the heavens. Had she continued to be so obstreperous, our journey would have been most trying. You remove that term out of your your vocabulary now, Scarlet. Obstreperous? Come on! You had to have looked up a thesaurus for that. You do not use that kind of word on a Should daily basis. Should she utilize her strength fully, it would be impossible for us to stop her. That is true. If they had taught her the way of the sword, she would have been legendary. Are you tempted? Mmm, tempted. If I said no, it would be a lie. I've never seen someone with such physical prowess. Wow. We all know how interested you are in physical strength. Ugh. Oh, to be a mentor watching all the physical developments of their disciples' physiques. Rapunzel, come on, that's a, that's a stretch, even for me. Perhaps teaching the pleasures of the flesh to the most learned disciples. <sighs> yes, yes! <laughs> oh my god, someone get this girl a dick. <laughs> Jesus. 
Y'all need Jesus. Um, where are we going? A safe place. What do you mean? Exactly what I said. Nowhere is safe up on the surface. So where are we going? Hmm. <sighs> it's a place raptures have no interest in. That's where you'll be living. Until your Prince Charming comes back for you. Oh. Hmm. I see. How far do we have to go? At our current speed, it will take about a week on foot. Wow. What? A week? You know what? Nikkei, they should be, they should have some technical prowess. I'm sure they could put together a vehicle. Five whole days? <laughs> Five days. A week is seven days. Oh, right. I knew that. I was just testing you. I assure you that I'm well aware of how many days are in a week. You don't have to test me. What's waiting for us over there? You'll find out when you get there. Mm. Keep walking. Mm. All right. She really is pushing her hard. You're right. That's not that hard. You're just walking. Um, excuse me. Come <sighs> It's Snow White. What? Is that your real name? Isn't that what you were about to ask me? No. It's just that the sun is down, and... Yes, night has fallen. Hmm? Hmm? I was told I should sleep at night. By who? The commander. Um, <laughs> Snow White. It's like, what is sleep? That's because he's human. Something which we are not. Forgoing sleep will not pose a problem for us. So we just keep walking? Yes. If we sleep, it will take twice as long. And as you're well aware, the surface is far from accommodating. We keep moving. <sighs> <laughs> All right. Oh. I think I think her English voice acting is is pretty good actually. Very endearing. Snow White, we should rest a bit. I agree. No. Unless we have no other choice, we should avoid camping outside altogether. Now would be a good time for us to rest. And what made you come to that conclusion? Marion is really struggling. It's all in her head. Nikkei's do not experience fatigue. You know as well as I do that's not true. <sighs> We have to maintain a steady pace the entire way through. If one of us increases the pace too much, it'll be too much for the others. <gasps> no, Rapunzel. Rapunzel, stop. This is a stretch. I'm all for the, the, for the spicy stuff, but you're really reaching. If one side increases the pace, <laughs> it'd be too much to handle. She oh, would beg no. you to stop. She'd cry that she couldn't take it anymore. She's worse than freaking darkness from Konosuba. Oh, yes. Right there. That's it. This is a rated T game. <laughs> Scarlet, you look like you've experienced too much of Rapunzel. There's a stream nearby. We should rest here. Yeah, so you could wash off later, right? <sighs> You mustn't underestimate the value of a good rest. For hardy folks like us who wander the surface, we can disregard our physical conditions. But such a thing could be dangerous for normal Nikkeis. It's funny they say that, but I remember in o the Overzone, they made it a big point to alternate guarding and people resting. So from how they're describing it now, it makes it seem like they just don't rest ever or need to at all. The strain could result in a mind switch. You of all people should know that. Okay. This always comes up. This is the universal limiter on why Nikkei can't just be like ever going. Anytime they, they need to throw in like a story plot line where they're like, oh, they're, you know, they talk about how strong Nikkei are, but yet there's always the threat of a mind switch. Marion only came up from the Ark today. <sighs> Very well. I didn't take everything into consideration. Let's take a break. Are you okay, Marion? Not really. Let's stay here and rest for a bit, okay? Okay. Hang in there. 
Um, none of you happen to have a blanket, do you? We're camping outdoors. Sorry to break it to you, but the bare ground will have to suffice. They have such nice outfits to so imagine that these Nikkei are just lying on the ground. Like with this thing on her back and with this gigantic hat, you know? Uh, just a moment. I'll try to find something for you to lie on. No, it's okay. I can manage. Hmm. Are you hungry? I am. I didn't ask you. Besides, you're always hungry. <laughs> that's that's kind of that's kind of uh, endearing. Are you hungry, Marion? I'm okay. <clears throat> Your body is telling us otherwise. I'll chance a visit to that stream close by. If I'm lucky, I could catch a few freshwater fish. Nice. Huh. <laughs> No way. What's a fish? Oh, you know what a fish is, Marianne. Would you like to see? Yes. Then follow me. You can keep me company. Aw, nearby hmm. stream. These are proving tougher to catch than I anticipated. What are you doing exactly? This is a tool called a fishing rod used to catch fish in the water. Don't be silly. Fish come from the refrigerator. <laughs> uh, there are various types of fish in the world. Mm -mm. Do they taste good? Their flavor is on a whole different plane, far exceeding whatever you have had in the Ark. So when will the fish come out? Patience, my friend. Nothing gets accomplished by rushing. Hmm. Oh. I feel like Scarlet could just slice them up. Like, there's a fish. Mine. Hey. Don't look so sad. But I am sad. <laughs> I'll marry it. Oh. Aww. Feel so bad for her. That is how the world works. As there are happy things, so there are sad things. How can life be full of only good things? How were things when you were with your commander? <laughs> it was nice. <laughs> Aww. So those were happy days. And today is a sad day. That's all there is to it. <laughs> when will the good times come back? Oh, that's right. Okay. So I just remembered something. Uh, evidently, Marion develops a bit of a drinking problem. I wonder who's a, who's responsible for that. Bad influence, Scarlet. Bad influence. That is up to you. Let me impart upon thee the secret to living life. Oh no! This is the scene. Think only of the good things. Oh wait. Then the good times will last longer and the melancholy will quickly fade. Should thou commence thinking of only good things now and set your heart to creating good things, the sadness of today will be washed away like tears in the rain. Okay. So I should think of only the commander? Well, don't be obsessive now. That would be one way of doing it. Think about the day you will be reunited. Isn't it pretty to think so? Yes. Think about that, then. Let those thoughts fill you with resolve and the will to live, and things will be different. Will to live. Damn. That's why pilgrims are built different. That's why they're like triple S units. Everyone except the... Uh, Isabel. <laughs> um, what should I call you? My name is Scarlet. Scarlet? What are the good things that you think about? Oh. Me. I think of cutting the queen's throat. <laughs> I think about the beauty of nature. What makes that so good? How wonderful it would feel to slash the throat of the one responsible for making the world what it has become. Gazing at its majesty provides a pleasure that never diminishes. Hmm. I don't think I quite understand. You don't have to. If you knew everything, what fun life would be- Ah! Oh. There's a small burst of activity in the stream and Scarlet's fishing rod bends. Attached to the end of the fishing line is a fish the length of her farm. This wow, is a big dude. one. Whoa, what is that thing? Flap, flap, flap. It's still moving. 
This is what they call a fish. How does it feel to see one in person? It looks kind of funny. <laughs> well, thou art nothing if not brutally honest. Is this what we're going to eat? That's right. We can't eat it straight away, though. We'll have to cook it first. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Whoa! Get, get into the good habits. Uh, I also... N never mind. Also what? Come here and sit. It might be hard since it's your first time. First time cooking? But try catching one yourself. Oh, uh, I see. Okay. What is this? What is this Renaissance Fair sounding music playing? What? <laughs> Scarlet and Marion come back with their arms full of fish. Wow, nice. Nice haul. <sighs> There's no way about to eat it all raw, dude. Wow, those are some real whoppers. How did you manage to catch so many? Am I dreaming? <laughs> Marion caught the lion's share of them. Wow. She's a natural. Hee <laughs> hee. Should we light a small fire? Nothing so big as to draw attention to ourselves. I guess just in general, Modernia slash Marion is just good at everything. I think that's kind of crazy. And kind of a good um, character trait, despite the fact that she's like basically like an infant. Scarlet can clean the fish and I'll handle the cooking. As for me, I'll get ready to eat. Could you at least go wash your face first? You've got drool dripping down your chin. Damn. I don't mind. <laughs> Why don't you set up the jammer then? Rapunzel pulls out a neatly tied bundle of her hair, which she had previously removed. On it. <sighs> You're not going to eat without me, are you? <laughs> Snow White. We won't take a bite until you're back, so don't worry. All right. I'm choosing to trust you. <laughs> Watch. Marion's gonna take a bite and then Snow White's gonna be all mad. Alright, Snow, Snow White walks away. <sighs> Marion, you can lie down over there and rest. Rapunzel gestures at some old blankets which have been spread out. Did she make it out of her hair? Are those blankets? Where did you get those? Turns out there was a village close by. Oh, okay. They may not measure up to what you'd find in the Ark. But they'll be better than nothing. All right. A lot of foraging and, and scavenging out here. <sighs> Go ahead. Marion awkwardly plops down on the old blankets. Rapunzel quickly sets to collecting some kindling and then ignites a bunch of dry grass with a fire starter. The spark catches and before long the surroundings are illuminated by dancing flames. Scarlet quickly guts and scales the fish then hands them to Rapunzel who skewers them on an iron rod she found lying nearby. Rapunzel then places the impaled fish near the Our fire. speed hath improved verily. Ah, verily. That's a Final Fantasy XIV term right there. I will accept that, Scarlet. <laughs> I'm glad we're at least getting better at something. It's a pity there's no salt. How are you holding up, Marion? Are you comfortable? Just sprinkle some dirt on it. <laughs> I... I'm fine. This will take some time to cook, so you can sleep for a bit. I'll wake you up when it's done. <sighs> Get some rest. We'll protect you. Oh, as Rapunzel, as soon as Rapunzel finishes speaking, Marion feels her eyelids getting heavy. The soft blankets, the crackling of the fire, the flickering flames. Marion quickly falls asleep without even realizing. <sighs> z -z 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 -z. That was fast. <laughs> How hard it must have been for her. Yeah. Fate has not been kind to her. It will only get worse going forward. A heretic coming back to humanity's side. I mean, that's a really good weapon to have. Just saying it out loud seems outrageous. She has a difficult life ahead of her. I mean, can we just ignore the fact that she's a heretic and just take advantage of the fact that she is buff as hell and sane and listening to the good side, you know? I feel like this kind of adhere like if if people could trust Nikkei's, then it shouldn't matter if they were once a heretic. And then again, I guess people are just like, ah, oh, she committed a bunch of crimes by killing a bunch of people or Nikkei. It's a plot tool to put the separation between them. 
Even though it doesn't make complete sense. I'll, I'll go along with it. What can we do for her? We must teach her how to press on. How to endure. Even when you're alone. We have two weeks. What? Why? We have to teach her everything we can during that time. What's what's with the deadline? Dost thou believe there will be a time when she's alone? <sighs> <laughs> yeah, Scarlet's asking the right question. It is a certainty. And when that time comes, we cannot be sure which side she will choose to stand on. Is there still a doubt? As long as Believer is present, things will not fall apart entirely, but... Oh... There are always uncertainties. That is what I believe as well. How do you think Snow White will feel? Snow White has already started. She's teaching her in her own way. You don't need to worry about that. Very well. You haven't eaten yet, have you? Shh. <laughs> <sighs> have you eaten? No, we haven't. It still needs to cook some more. I'm sure we could eat it now and be fine. <laughs> That's not the point. It simply wouldn't taste good. Again, I don't see the problem. Snow White, calm down. Just hold your horses. Ah, <sighs> fine. <laughs> she be, she's become so rough and tough. She's very much a wilderness nut at this point. Whoa! I've never oh, seen something artwork. like this before. Oh, this is oh that this is so good. This is such a treat. It doesn't provide any gameplay whatsoever. Maybe some gems, of course, but the fact that it's, this is just pure story, I think it's a treat. And I, I'm sure that there's a big chunk of the fan base that will be appreciating this this side story, you know? And it's all voiced! That That's even, that's the best part, too. Oh my gosh. This would be tough if we had to read it, read it all. Dost thou enjoy it? Very much! Then have mine. Really? Certainly. Take it. Good her boobs. You can have mine as well. Okay. Thanks. I thought you got. I thought you guys like caught like a ton of fish. There should be plenty to go around. <sighs> Snow White. What is it, Snow White? Something wrong? Uh, do I have to give her mine too? <laughs> well, we already gave her ours, so you can keep yours to yourself. Forsooth, Marion's appetite truly is most prodigious. Prodigious. Forsooth, prodigious. Remove that from your vocabulary now, Scarlet. No one says these things. <laughs> then again, this is her first time eating proper food from up on the surface. Tis most sensible. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is really delicious. <sighs> Take it. Aw. Snow White gives the fish she was holding oh. to Marion. Shock face. <laughs> Shocked face. Can I eat this too? Yes. <laughs> She's still drooling. Thanks. <laughs> Snow White. Aw. You're not experiencing a mind switch or anything like that, are you? No. Hmm. <laughs> Is it good? Really good. You're not going to eat the bones, are you? Are the bones this hard stuff? I don't think I should eat that. Good. Oh, no. <laughs> Snow White. Hmm? You could have had at least one Snow White. It's okay. <laughs> After a few moments. Wait, so did Mary just eat all the food? The, the sumptuous fireside banquet has been consumed in its entirety. Marion lies down on the ground sleeping. Why don't we let Marion stay with us? Yeah, I feel like that's... So simple. We are always in danger. And we don't usually move in a group like this. Why don't you guys move in a group like this? It, it would make sense to. Today was a special case. I know, but we can take turns accompanying her. No. Marion needs a place to stay. She hasn't fully recovered mentally, and she needs something tangible to hold on to. Having a single fixed location is the best option for that. Hmm. The Ark can no longer serve that function for her. She was driven away, and there is no guarantee that she'll ever be able to go back. Of course, Eden is also an option. 
That's not a viable option either. Dorothy is there. Wait. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> this confirms that they know where Dorothy is. I feel like they would know that, considering, like, you know, they're, they're the badass Nikkei. They should know a lot of things. But I, I do like that it is confirmed that one of their former comrades is in Eden. Hmm. I understand. You just want to take on a disciple. <laughs> Snow White. I, I can't deny that. It's still early. We have things to do. What is that? I know. I know very well. What is? What are the things you have to do? You're fighting. You're looking. What? Looking for the queen? I got a bit greedy. Forgive me. It's best to avoid places like this where the mud is thick. It could be a swamp. Oh. Were someone of our mass to fall into a swamp, it would be all over. Oh, uh, wow. World building. What's a swamp? Think of it as a pit you can never get out of. <coughs> Can't you just jump out of it? <coughs> Imagine multiple hands holding you back so that you can't jump. What would hands be doing in a pit? <laughs> I do not speak of real, literal hands. <sighs> Maybe you don't want a disciple, Scarlet. Are you sure there are hands in there? How do they move? Uh. <laughs> she, she's over it. She's so over it. Yeah, no, we're gonna leave this bitch wherever we can the next time there's an opportunity. There are many useful items in abandoned places like this. Blankets, firewood, stuff like that. Isn't that stealing? No, since they don't have an owner. But they might come back. That won't happen, Marion. How do you know? Oh, no. Let me put it this way. If they're covered in dust or cobwebs... You must you... kill a rapture the moment you lay eyes on it. They're teaching her. She's learning! Why do we have to kill it? If you don't, it will kill you. Why would it kill us? Because raptures are bad guys. <laughs> Why are raptures bad? They uh -oh. just are. She's speaking like a heretic! Kill her! Why? There is no why. They just are. When venturing off into the unknown, one state of mind is paramount. If you control your mind, there is nothing to fear in this world. How do you control your mind? I drink alcohol. <laughs> oh, oh no. Oh no, this is it. This is what happened. Huh? If you drink alcohol, everything in the world becomes perfectly peaceful. Sounds nice. I'd like a drink. Uh -oh. oh, really? Oh no, Scarlet, what have you done? Hey, wait a minute. Oh no. When you explore a village, you might find things like books. They're big and heavy and not easy to carry around. But if you take the time to read them, the way you look at the world might change. What is this book? <sighs> oh no. Finding Passion, Volume 1. Oh no! I knew it. I knew it. What's a masterpiece doing in a place like this? Will my perspective on the world change if I read this? Oh no. They're no. They're going to give her a bad influence. She's going to be a drunk. She's going to be looking at porn. And then she's going to be a glutton because of Snow White. Oh my gosh. Like the three, de three of the deadly sins right there. You bet it will. This won't just give you a new perspective. It'll open up a whole new world for you. Ah. Uh, wow. Can I read it? Oh, no. Do you really want to? Look who's looking for a disciple now, huh? Huh? Uh, okay. Let me show you. Ah, uh, shit. Remember this. Okay. Eat when you can. Don't be picky. Eat whatever you can find. How do I distinguish what I can eat? It's simple. Just try eating it. <laughs> Is this something I can eat? Marin points at a nearby rock. <sighs> so I was like, no, nah, I tried it. I've never tried it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> she is a glutton. She's going to teach her to eat too much. Should we? Sure. Let's give it a shot. 
It's good to be adventurous and try new things. Oh, there goes their Nikkei teeth. Okay. Please don't do that. <laughs> Scarlet? Is she drunk? Yes. Can I have more <gasps> alcohol? Oh no. Huh. She's gonna drink all of Scarlet's alcohol. You seem to be drinking a lot lately. Shit. My mind's too loud! I want it to be quiet! Give me some more, please! Oh! This is this is starting to be a like a tragic story of unraveling of a the unraveling of a character who was once innocent, now falling victim to vices and indul overindulgence. Oh no. I don't like where this is going. Fine. One more glass. <sighs> Lovely. Snow White. What is it? I tried making rice balls with sawdust and centipedes earlier. Uh-huh. And I have to say, I think they're my masterpiece. Yikes. <laughs> She's drooling! Oh my gosh, no way! Put some in your backpack so you can have some whenever you're hungry. Um, thank you. Oh. oh. Rapunzel? Oh no, now she's gonna talk about porn. Yes? Don't you think the fire looks a bit like a man playing with his? <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my. It, you're right. It absolutely does! You guys... I can't believe it! This... We left them with the worst three individuals in the Earth to look after such an innocent Nikkei. Why didn't I think of that? Yeah, Cause your mind ain't dirty enough, apparently. Huh. And her, her mind ain't drunk enough. I have a feeling things are not going the way I thought. Yeah. They they started with started off with wanting to teach her, and they taught her the worst aspects of each of their characteristics. Bring me some alcohol, Rapunzel. Hold her. Got it. Pinch. Uh, oh no. How did you do that in one shot? You're amazing. What? Do what in one shot? Why are you praising her? What is going on? <laughs> the thoroughly satisfied Rapunzel slumps to the ground. Oh my gosh, girl. Pull yourself together. Oh my gosh. Uh, these are triple S units that are like SSS tier in battle. Are you kidding me? One of them is eating a rice ball made out of sawdust and centipedes. This girl just a drunk and this girl like or literally came from one touch. What is going on? I want booze. Marion, sit down. No, I refuse. Uh oh, uh oh, <laughs> unruly, unruly. Why are you wearing your underwear on the outside again? <laughs> You're but supposed anyways. to wear your underwear under your clothing. It doesn't affect my movement, so what does it matter? Hmm. Come to think of it, you're right. I can't refute that. Oh, come on, Snow White. You're not that much of a... of a brute. You used to work on an airship. She's just become a total savage out in the wilderness. Oh, for goodness sake. Try and think of something. I give it a try. Oh my gosh. Hmm. Guess not. Firepower! Firepower! Oh no. The inner neon's coming out. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's one way to end it off. I can't believe. What kind of monster have we created? Right, Scarlet? Y'all should be ashamed of yourself. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this. I'm- I'm- 
I as a commander, I'm taking her back right now. Y'all need to like get several miles away from her. You can leave her with me. Oh my gosh. The next day. Uh, uh, my head hurts. My stomach doesn't feel so good either. Commander, I'm sick. Marion, no, oh, I wish I could be there. She hasn't sobered up just yet. <laughs> Poor girl. Frankly, it's amazing that she's even mobile. Before Nikki is all plod along without a word. After about an hour. Rapture detected. Oh, it's time. A rather formidable one at that. Which formation should we use? I'll go first. Snow White runs Pray off. Pray tell, why is she in such a hurry? We should go too. Let's. Oh, are we actually fighting? Seventh dwarf ready. Oh, we are fighting. Oh, oh, this is cool. My orders are simple. Kill every last rapture you see. Okay. Seven dwarves ready. Encounter. Okay, this is this is pretty cool. Like actual battles that is like, um, like canon and not just random raptures thrown in front of the characters. All right, all right, get it, get him, get him. Fully active, blast away. Hold, hold, hold. All the way, all the way, all the way. Come on, come on. Unleash. I feel it's actually pretty cool when like the, the rapture battles are like immersive and canon. Prepare to meet your maker. Oh, full team! Thou full team! In most impetuously, but you seem to be having a hard time. No, I'll show them. You say that, but it looks to me that you sustained some bodily injuries. Oh? Can't you fix it? Of course! Rapunzel, back us up. Snow White, come with me. Let's go. Let's go! Uh, I'm swapping over to Scarlet. The seven the garden of Shangri-La! No pain or despair! Focusing How's fire! This? Leave no oh, enemy ow. standing! We all of us remain standing. Do what you have to do. Get him, get him! Please wait a minute. Uh, we're, we're fighting, we're fighting. All burst symbol. Nice. This is cool! It actually I mean it's like a minor difference, but it's still pretty cool. Like that we're actually they're actually fighting as on their own without a commander, you know. This this totally opens up a whole new dimension for like Nikkei story battles. The seven dwarves. Seven. I'm charging! I'm charging! I'm shoot it right at his face. Ugh. <laughs> let's get both. We let's get both of the legs. All right, got. He's down. He's down. We're nearly there. Time to finish this. This is so cool. Stay frosty out there. Of course. Like I don't think we can actually lose, but I'm still gonna try hard. Damn. Nice, nice. Good job, good job, team. Good job, team. Clear. Nice. That was quite the challenge. That was, that was pretty cool. I was not expecting to have any battle. It has been quite some time since we encountered them, and then they came out of nowhere. It's almost like you, if you with you guys together, there's really nothing to fear on the surface. Do you think there's a reason for that? Except maybe maybe a heretic. Because I know that heretic's a super buff. <sighs> I don't know. Maybe it's because they're, they're avoiding her? And Nikkei's resume walking. And another hour later. Snow White, Scarlet, and Rapunzel all stop in unison. As if on cue. This is where you come in, Snow White. We'll leave it to you. Alright. Marion, Scarlet, and I are going to head our own way from here. Okay. <laughs> Thou dost resemble a member of the Walking Dead. <laughs> are you okay with this, Snow White? I'm fine with it. Shouldn't we all stick together? Really? 
There's no reason to separate. I think it's weird that you guys do. When Marion comes to her senses, she's likely to throw a fit. No. It's kind of like Marion is Snow White and then now Snow White is Red Hood. Like in terms of like role switch. We have things to do. It's not efficient for all of us to move together. If you say so. We all have our own tasks to take care of at this point. What ta- what task? Come on. Give us- give us a little bit. What are you doing? Furthermore, it wouldn't be smart for all of us to know where Marion will be hiding. Why? Are you- you feel like you might be, like, brain controlled into revealing it? Yes. It would be dangerous if our brains were scanned. Oh. Hmm. I should just let them answer the questions. <laughs> I have a rough idea of where she'll be going, though. Okay. I'll leave the rest in your capable hands, Snow White. Yeah. Right. Rapunzel approaches Marion. See you around, Marion. Uh, 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 my head hurts. Carry me, Commander. Oh, man. That sucks. We left her. That's like the worst feeling, too. Being hungover and vulnerable. Oh, that's the worst. <sighs> Let's go. All right. Okay, so Scarlet and Rapunzel both head off in opposite directions. So does that mean she's going to be hanging out with Snow White? Snow White gazes at them for a while and then takes Marion's hand and begins to walk. Oh, well, they're holding hands. After three hours or so have passed. Oh, the reveal! The reveal of the kingdom! A towering fortress stands before you. You morons! Chime. You said you would be here in a week. It's been two whole weeks! Oh, I forgot about that. I had to throw away all the food I made. I've been keeping watch constantly to see when you were coming. <laughs> now you show up all of a sudden without telling me? What do you expect me to do? Something came up. Her, her English voice actor is completely different to the Japanese. As far as, like, character direction. Like, she sounds more like a gremlin. <laughs> in Japanese, but here she sounds normal. Oh, I can imagine. I expect a proper explanation for all of this. Ew, I'm not sure I like that. Ugh, too loud. My head. Oh no. Who are you to call me loud? I've got a right to be loud when I'm this angry. Ugh. Is this the child? Is this the child? The chosen child? Yes. Huh. <sighs> Come in. Her Highness is waiting. My stomach doesn't feel good. What's wrong with you? What happened on the way here? A whole lot. Hurry up and get inside. <laughs> I don't have much, but I've at least got some basic medicine. Aww. Chime grabs Marion's arm and slings it over, uh, slings it across her shoulder. As Marion's arm grazes Chime's back, she winces. <laughs> You. Oh. Uh, sorry. Did she like throw up or something? Uh. Uh. Huh? <laughs> oh, poor girl. <clears throat> Is something wrong? I've got a killer migraine, that's what. <laughs> Are you sure you're not faking? You didn't experience any physical trauma. Sure, but what about mental trauma? Anyway, I gave her some herbs that are good for hangovers. Ah. She's conked out now. Wow. That must have been the good stuff, right? Thank you. So, tell me how it went. Uh, badly. They just walked. <laughs> there were some small issues along the way, but nothing major. Yeah, a tyrant class... A uh, freaking rapture that they just killed with a party of only three. Except for one thing that was rather strange. What is it? There hasn't been a single rapture attack. Isn't that because of Rapunzel's hair? Rapunzel's hair isn't foolproof. It simply lowers the probability of an encounter. It's been two whole weeks, and we haven't encountered a single rapture. Do you think it's somehow related to that girl? Oh, probably, yeah. Maybe. 
No. Definitely. Mm, got it. I'll keep that in mind. What about Crown? On the way here. Hello, Snow White. It's been a while. <laughs> you know, a lot of people are looking forward to her being a character. I think she's kind of weird. Her design's pretty neat, but like, you know, nothing too appealing. I just think she's kind of silly. I hope you've been in good health. <laughs> hey, you ingrate! Her Highness is talking to you! Alright, alright. So the girl is sleeping? It must have been a difficult trip for her. Her hair being all over, like, the her wing things is a, I don't know, it kind of bugs me a little bit. But, you know, I don't know. It's fine. Also, she has a coat. So that means that when she shoots the gun, that ass is hidden. Just putting that out there. Before anyone looks forward to Crown being a playable character. I appreciate you doing this. Hmm. I sense a vibration. I mean, I'm hungry, but my stomach doesn't growl that much. <laughs> Inbound raptures? Yes, a large one. Oh, wow. Pirate class. What? <laughs> We're amongst friends, your highness. Using our secret code names for the raptures might prove to be a slight headache for our new arrival. <laughs> I believe we can safely refer to them as tyrant class. I knew it! And these 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 Nikkei are like so unfazed by it. I think that's kind of like I don't know. It says a lot about how powerful they're supposed to be. Oh, uh, very well. My apologies. Caution is simply in a queen's nature. At any rate, a tyrant class rapture is headed our way. No, oh, ain't no thing. No, it's, you know it's on our way. It must have followed us. Let me deal with it. I'll take care of it as I'm leaving. <laughs> it's no way. It's like, I'll get it on the way out. Let us help you. No, you take care of Marion. No, come on, come on. I want to see them fight. Things might get chaotic when she wakes up. I'll leave her to you. Do you have any messages for her? Messages? Tell her I'll be back for her. And to take care of herself in the meantime. Oh, no. And now she has a drinking problem. All right. Don't worry. We'll take care of her. Don't worry. We'll take care of her. I know you will. Are you leaving straight away? Yes. Yes, because apparently she got some task or whatever. Are you serious? First, you take forever and a day to get here, and then you leave almost immediately? Yeah. Next time, I'll know better than to prepare anything when you say you'll be coming. <laughs> Aw, she's butthurt. At least prepare me a meal. Damn. <sighs> Damn. Damn, I'm so blunt. Take this. Snow White hands three capsules to Crown. What is this? If any black light starts emanating from Marion's body, use these. Oh, are those the... The... The bullets? They contain trace amounts of Vapaus and will put any nanomachines out of commission. Okay, okay. So, like, as to, like, remove corruption or something. It will prevent her from transforming. Alright. Note it. So she got, like, three three Valpas bullets just laying around, I guess. I'm off. Be careful. Snow White walks Ugh, away. No social skills whatsoever. <laughs> hmm. I mean, I don't think these guys are all, like, great at it either. Hmm. With their little queen roleplay, whatever fetish they're in <laughs> into. Well then, shall we roll out the red carpet for our new citizen? Citizen. Yes, your highness. Bro, this music reminds me of like music that you hear right before boarding like some kind of experience at Disneyland. Welcome to the Inner Dome. Witness the latest technology in an immersive experience in 4D 4K Ultra Vision. <laughs> yeah. Please keep your hands and arms and please supervise your children. Para su seguridad. <laughs> Three days later! You didn't eat anything again. Nikkei's may not have to eat in order to survive, but it can be a real boost for your mental health to do so. <sighs> oh no, she got that dead stare. I don't like that. I don't like that. That means, that means shit's about to go down. Say something. Oh no, she's going comatose. If you just sit there and give us the silent treatment, there's nothing we can do to help you. 
Fine, I'll wait. I'll leave this here. Make sure you eat it. Chime leaves the plate of food and leaves the room. <sighs> no, she's like like undergoing like some kind of psychosis. She hasn't eaten anything or said a word for three days. Yes, it must be hard for her to accept. I'm sure being ousted from the Ark was traumatic for her, but thankfully she's got some friends in the Goddess Squad. Be that yeah. as it may, yeah. the fact still stands that when she woke up, everyone was gone. Damn. We, she drank too much, she got hung over, and she got abandoned. That's that's actually that's a feels bad. I'd feel bad too. I'm sure she thinks she's been abandoned. Yeah? Even without a word? It's a tragic state of affairs, but time will solve it. For the moment, our hands are tied. All we can do is wait for her to... She even dares not to see the queen when she pays her a visit. I won't stand for it. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Insubordination. The queen won't stand. Huh? Chime, starting from today, I don't want you paying Marion any more visits. Oh, no. I will do it. Oh. Okay, okay. I thought she was about to get all haughty and be like, Oh, I'm a queen! I get disrespect! What's your plan, your highness? I shall treat her with the dignity that a queen is capable of. Okay. Huh. I would advise against that. You mustn't stoop so low as to appease her. I said I would do it, and so I will. Yeah, as the, cle as the queen decrees. Oh, okay. Crown stands up, Marion's room. <sighs> Look at her. Oh, she she big depressed. Squeak, stud. Crown opens the door, enters, and brings over a chair to sit down. <sighs> <laughs> I'm just gonna drink my tea right here. <sighs> the two women stare at each other blankly without exchanging any words. They continue to do so until night has fallen. At which Crown stands up and leaves the room. <sighs> oh no, she's so sad. She's so sad. Aww. <laughs> no! Oh no, this is hard. Oh no, now she's like super sad. Commander. Oh man! For the rest of the night, Crown listens to Marion crying behind the door. Morning comes. Thud. Sweet thud. All right, Crown opens the door, enters, and brings the chair to sit down. Okay, so she's going to keep doing this until she breaks. Hmm. Night falls once again. Crown stands up and leaves the room and listens to Marion crying from behind the door. And so the, the process repeats on the next day. And the day after that, Crown sits opposite Marion, her usual wordless self. Morning comes, thud, sweet. Crown opens the door, enters, and brings over a chair to sit down. Why aren't you saying anything? Oh, she cracked. My kind does not speak unless it is necessary. What are you doing here? Okay, opening up. I'm observing one of my subjects. What are you talking about? The moment you entered my kingdom, you became one of its citizens. <sighs> <laughs> I irritate you, don't I? Wow, choice words. Not at all. Why not? I know other people feel that way. The commander and the others. They all hate me. Oh no! She actually believes that? Oh man! I'm useless. All I do is drag people down. In your current state, it is true that you're of no help to anyone. <laughs> That's right. What you gonna say back now, bitch? Huh? I just told you what you need to hear. You useless. But I will protect you nonetheless. <laughs> you don't know me. Oh, she's going. Oh, she. Oh, she's upset now. You were only doing that because you were ordered to. Ordered to by who? It is a queen's duty to protect her subjects. And so that is precisely what I will do. <sighs> I wonder how strong Crown is. She must be, like, busted. Fine. Since I'm not helpful in any way, I'll leave. <gasps> where will you go? I... Where? 
Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to see the commander. I'm going to the Ark. No, don't do that. Good. Let's go. Oh. Okay. I'll take you there. The way there is fraught with peril, and so I will protect you. You will? Did you get all that chime? A voice rings from behind the door. Yes, your highness. And Trom? Trom! Oh yeah, On the other way. way. Oh yeah, that's the horse, right? The ground begins to shake, accompanied by ringing of bells. Marion looks out the window. What is that? Out in the courtyard, a gleaming steel horse is standing. Let's go. Interesting. So that means that she potentially has gone to the Ark? Kind of to see like how things are, right? Oh, that's a cool shot right there. That's a nice wallpaper. All three of them on the horse. <laughs> Using the moonlight, Trom gallops with mighty fury. With the three Nikkei's astride. The moonlight and the wind part before them. <laughs> it's too fast! I knew we'd be going at a snail's that's what pace she said. with three riders. Still, at our current speed, we should be there in four days or so. Too fast. Huh, that must be a really fast horse. Arrive where? Where else? The Ark. The Ark. Huh? Uh, are we really going to the Ark? Isn't that where you said you wanted to go? A queen is duty-bound to protect her subjects, and so we are accompanying you. Uh, but it's dangerous. What is? She'd be like, again, like with raptures, she's just like, what are they? Like little insects in the way, you know? Everything! Not only will this put both of you in danger, but it'll also put the commander in harm's way. That is true, but I will protect you all the same. Clip clop, clip clop, clip clop. <sighs> clip clop, clip clop. <sighs> Let's go back. She decided. She's realizing. Why? We've already made it this far. Go back. I'm sorry. Um... Your Highness! Trom, <coughs> stop. Let's go back to the kingdom. Aww. A little bit of character development, right? She kind of like... Really feeling the situation and like... Realizing... Maybe a little bit more maturity, right? Trom saunters slowly, carrying the 3 d on, on its back. Across the dark plain, only the sound of clomping hooves fills the night air. <sighs> what are you thinking? I'm sorry. I guess there was no other way. Oh. You know, point of realization. She's coming to terms. Everyone knew except for me. To be honest, I knew too. It's just that... It was all so sad. Wow. It felt like I was abandoned and all alone. You're not alone. True. She's got a new crew, right? You have me. Don't forget about me. <laughs> Don't you worry, Chime. I could never forget you. <sighs> you came here not of your own volition, brought by others, and yet you have formed such a strong bond with the Queen. <laughs> yeah, by the queen just sitting there staring, right? As part of this kingdom, you are one of its subjects. And with that divine right comes certain responsibilities. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Like what? You may do whatever you wish, and the queen will provide unequivocal protection. No matter what? Yes, but you must consider carefully whether what you are doing is what you truly desire. So great is the queen's nobility and so majestic her power Majestic her power, huh? That she can make any of your wishes reality <laughs> Hmm... Asking for the Queen's protection is not something that should be taken lightly So you <laughs> must think very hard before you act Hmm... Alright Makes me wonder where the Queen came from Where Crown... When did Crown and Chimes set up a little that little kingdom, right? Uh, evidently they're pilgrims. Should you have a wish that you want to fulfill no matter the cost, then you may speak with the queen. She will lend you her aid and your wish will come true. Do you understand what I'm telling you? Yes. I think I understand, miss... Call me Chime. Chime. 
What is your wish? It already came true. What oh. was it? Hmm. I wished for a queen. <laughs> then what is the wish of the queen? To protect her subjects. That is all. My personal desires are of no importance. Okay. A queen exists because of and for her subjects. Oh. Hmm, what a hard way to live. <laughs> Mary's like, man, y'all need better wishes. Ah! Marion! How many times must I tell you not to put those disgusting maggots on the table? Oh. <laughs> she looking she foraging like she did with Snow White. Maggots are super nutritious. They're way healthier than any processed or canned food, that's for sure. <laughs> what does that matter, you dolt? We're Nikes. Why don't you quit hitting the bottle before talking about nutrition? Damn, called out. Alcohol is the perfect cure for an ailing mind. Damn, Scarlet, what have you done? That sounds just like something a drunk would say. Yeah. Giving alcohol to someone so vulnerable. And she's basically a child. Your Highness, must I endure <clears throat> such unwarranted criticism? This woman has made my mealtimes a living hell. <laughs> Marion put a lot of thought into this meal. Be thankful and eat. <laughs> Crown's like, eat up! Not you too, Your Highness. How can you be so cruel? <laughs> Thanks, Crown. Don't forget to finish yours. Oh, no. Nah, uh, I'm a bit full. Actually. <laughs> While we're on the subject of health, I noticed that you've seemed a bit tired these days, so I brewed some snake wine for you, Crown. Snake wine? Hmm. Snake wine? <laughs> her face! Such insolence! How dare you say her highness's name as if she was your friend! Oh yeah, that's right. She did just call it Crown. It's fine. It's nice being treated as an equal. <laughs> you are most merciful, Crown. <laughs> As any queen should be. Wait right here. I'll go get the snake wine. How do you brew snake wine? Hmm. She's like, uh, oh my god. Marion opens the door and leans um, out. <coughs> Your Highness. Yes. Don't you think Marion changed a bit after that day? A day where she got through to her? It must be the adolescence kicking in. During adolescence, people tend to change every day. <laughs> Chime glances around and then whispers softly. You mean to say that she's growing, right? <laughs> um, yes, that's exactly what I meant. <laughs> she is growing up well. <laughs> I don't think this can explain. Ugh. <sighs> Are you okay, Your Highness? I haven't been feeling well for the past few days. What? Oh, now she's dying? What? This won't do. You must rest at once. I'll prepare a separate meal for you. Hmm. If you would. Thank you. <laughs> Brown gets up from her seat and heads into her room. Hmm. Moment later. Huh? Where's Crown? She isn't feeling well, so she's resting. Mm. Yeah, she hasn't been looking all that great for a few days now. Oh no! Has something like this happened before? Oh no, does Crown have some kind of ailment? She has a difficult time whenever there's a high concentration of Alva particles. Oh... Does Marion generate that? Is that why there are no raptures? I think alpha particles just mess up like radars and stuff. I'm trying to remember what the what the world rules are. Is she sensitive to alpha particles? Yes, but I can't tell you any more than that. Oh, what a letdown. Oh no. I'll tell you later. <laughs> okay. <laughs> By the way, have you received any word from Snow White? Nothing yet. Um... Are you still upset that she left without saying goodbye? Not at all. They're busy people, and they have lots of important things to do. Important things that I would like to know more of what it is. Despite all that, they still brought me all the way out here, so I'm very grateful to them. It's just... I miss them. 
Aww. She missed eating caterpillars, looking at porn, and drinking alcohol. Now that I realize what they did for me... Hmm... I'm curious what they think of you now as well. Would you like to join me for a glass of snake wine? <laughs> I found a classic movie. It's called My Frisky Stepsister Part 3. We can watch that while having oh, a few drinks. Oh my gosh! What has happened to Marion? <laughs> Frisky Steps! Oh my gosh. Ah. Oh. Marion abruptly wakes up. <gasps> she looks beyond the castle gate outside the window, and her expression darkens. She opens the door, heads out. <gasps> mm. Marion? What are you doing at this hour? Do you need to use the bathroom? Wait just a sec. I'll go with you. No, it's okay. I'm just having a hard time falling asleep. Oh. I was going to take a short walk outside for a few minutes. Uh, at this hour? Yeah. Hmm. Okay. Mm, just be careful and don't venture outside the kingdom. I won't. Good night. By the way. Uh, yes? How's Crown? Uh, still unwell. This time it's lasting longer than I thought. Oh no, it pretty sure it might have to do with uh, Marion somehow. I see. I hope she gets better soon. Don't worry, her highness is strong. I know. I'll be back. Alright, take care. She's just gonna walk out. Marion opens the door, heads out. Marion walks outside the castle wall. After walking for a while, she stops. Beyond the horizon, figures can be seen. Three tyrant class raptures! What the f Is the kingdom what they're after? Maybe they're after you. The castle walls are slowly losing their ability to conceal this place. So more and more raptures have been coming. <sighs> if they breach the walls, Crown and Chime won't be able to stop them. Crown is sick now, and Chime is not a combat, Nikkei. Well... I'm... maybe. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Her curves, man. I'm I'm sorry. I'm, I'm I've been eyeing that. I have to stop them. Wow, this soundtrack so dramatic. She's oh, Marion's going out to stop them herself. She's being protective. Oh, man. It's kind of it's kind of nice to see the side of her kind of. How about you? I've got your back. Or nothing. I can't allow you to come inside the kingdom. I have to stop you here! I mean, killing these Nikes must be nothing for her, right? Uh. Alright, ulti, ulti, ulti. Get them all, get them all. Poor thing. Dead. Right away, right away. Clear! Next! This is starting to wear me down, but it's not over yet! You would think that Crown or Chime would hear the battling, right? All right, ulti right now. Huh? They're all down. Dead. Phew! Last one. I can do this. Wow, she's just mopping them up by herself. That'll be cool if like. Crown comes in, maybe a little preview on how she fights. You shall not pass. <laughs> okay, Gandalf. Let's get this gun on the right. Focus right, focus right. He's almost dead. Boom, we're done. <laughs> and that should be caught up. Wow, this story is taking a while. Thud. What's that thud? <sighs> There's more. Thud, thud. It's okay. I can do it. Aaron staggers. Maybe I overdid it a little. Uh oh. Thud, thud. It doesn't matter. Let's go. Oh, oh! Here comes uh, 
The horsey? Onward, Trom. Trom. <gasps> oh, they're fighting! <gasps> okay, okay, let's see, let's see, let's see this. Trom and Crown soar past Marion in the flash and jump up. Crown fires off one shot and scores a direct hit on the raptor's core. Crown. Chime the subcore. On it. Chime unloads a barrage of bullets which shatter the raptor's subcore. The hulking raptor collapses to the ground defeated. Wow. One shot. <sighs> Enemy down. Well done. What? How? I'm supposed to be the one protecting you. Not the other way around. I thought you were sick. I can overcome anything if my subjects need protection. Aww. And that's how Crown, Chime, and Marion got together and became best friends. I'm that important to you? Of course. And I hope you hold me in equally high esteem. Hmm. <sighs> you idiot! You should have told us something! You even lied to my face! <laughs> <laughs> You're laughing? You think this is funny? <laughs> it's not that. When I saw those raptures, I felt this power surge through me. I felt an irrepressible urge to protect the kingdom and all those in it. Aww. Did you all feel the same way? Of course. That is precisely what it means to protect someone you care about. <sighs> right. I see. I understand now. If you protect me, and I protect you, there's no limit to how strong all of us can become. No one has to get hurt. It's so simple. I can't believe it took me so long to see it. The more things you share with someone, the greater your resolve becomes. Uh, yeah, yeah. Huh? Oh, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. A black light emits from Marion's body. What she was just she just had a breakthrough. And she starts to transform. Your Highness! No, this isn't what you think it is. <sighs> Marion! Your body! Commander! Rappy! Anise! Neon! <gasps> oh my god! Oh my god, she looks so pretty! Oh my god, I was not expecting this! This is so good! Is this gonna be her altar? Is this what's gonna happen in the half anniversary? Wow! I am stunned! I was not expecting this to be the payoff for all of this! This is so good! Snow White, Scarlet Rapunzel, Crown and Chime, protect me! And I will do the same! Look at that! Wow! I promise you, I'll protect all of you! <gasps> oh wow! I was, I was so worried that her, her character growth would cause her to have a setback to where they had to like, I don't know, like erase her mind again? But no, it's the opposite! She progressed with a hotter outfit, and I guess these little uh, dragon looking things that for some reason, all pilgrims have. Second affection end. There's more? Your Highness. We've got a big problem. Uh-oh. What is it, Chime? While I was surveying the surroundings with a telescope, I saw a massive explosion. Big enough to be seen from a distance, it came from the direction of the Ark. Uh oh, oh maybe this is when when the heretic went into the ark. <gasps> hmm, I think something's happened there. Make preparations to leave. Are you planning on going there yourself? Yes, I have to. Understood. I'll accompany you. Wait, hold on. We saw them briefly on the way to like Red Hood's town. Hmm, I'm trying to think back to. When else we when else we encountered them? Marion. I'll wait here. Oh. 
I want to go with you, but that might only make things more dangerous. Oh, she's like all matured now. Oh. Thank you for understanding. Are you going to be okay here on your own? <laughs> of course. It's it's insane. She looks so good. Wow. Wow. All right. Do you have anything you want to say to him? Hmm? You mean the commander? Yes. Did she say something to me? Why would... I have a feeling I might meet him. When I listen to your stories, it seems like he's usually involved in most major events. <laughs> That's putting it lightly. Hmm. If you see the commander, just tell him I'm doing well. Oh, she's so sweet. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is the person I'm fighting for. I wish she wasn't like so like immature. But you know, she's she's maturing. <laughs> okay. Let's go, Chime. Yes, your highness. <sighs> oh, she said. Hmm. She also looks like a VTuber model. <laughs> Commander. Like straight up, she's a VTuber model cuz the fact that she's standing really straight with her arms kind of just uh, moving around with an idle animation. She could totally be a VTuber model. Will we ever meet again? I want to see what her whole outfit looks like. We will. We will, Marion. Oh, that's the uh, reward. That's so good. Ah. Uh, oh my gosh, that was amazing. These, these updates. Okay, okay. Okay, shift up, you're cooking. This this update slapped. It didn't require any like un you know unnecessary rapture battles. And when it was a rapture battle, it was like canon. Like it was an actual battle. Not just some random Oh, we need to fight a few raptures here. Even though in the main story, no raptures actually showed up. No, this is This is insane. I like it. I like it a lot. This is a good Oh my gosh, I was not expecting that reveal at the end. That was so worth it. This was really chunky too. This took a long time to get through. But at the same time, I really like, I mean, I love all the characters that are involved. I'm like iffy about Chime and, um, what's her name? Chime and Crown. I love the, the pilgrims, like Rapunzel, Scarlet, and, and Snow White. Like, I love their dynamic. I love their, their part in the story. Anytime I get to see them, it's awesome in the past and now here in the future. So I was iffy about Crown and and Chime, but seeing them and you know witnessing their development, I think they're charming. They're a little they're they're wacky. And I think that does kind of pair well with uh Marion who's also kind of wacky and quirky because of like how immature she is right now. But that reveal at the end of her developing, I thought I was expecting something totally opposite i thought she was gonna regress but wow that is awesome that is awesome this is a good good update good update i love it i love it